Hey, Dr. Joe Feuerstein with the MD Minute and thanks for tuning in. Today, a quick MD Minute looking at something we've spoken about before, just a little bit more detail on the link between diet and mood disorders like anxiety and depression. So this is a study that was published, researchers in China, it was published in BMC Medicine, a well-known um, uh, journal, and it was looking at a data set we've spoken about before, the UK Biobank. And this is 127,000 people that are followed for seven and a half years. Our average age is 55. There's more women than men. And what they do is they look at what their nutritional status is. But in this particular case, they were looking at dietary patterns and then how many of them over a period of seven years will develop anxiety and depression because, as I've said before, anxiety and depression are linked to what you eat. So they looked at this and they had three dietary patterns. And the dietary pattern that I want to talk about was the one most associated with anxiety and depression. And that was one that had two substances that in my first book, I've written a couple of books, The Dr. Joe's Man Diet, I talk about saturated fat and sugar as two of the evils. The other one is starch. But in this particular thing, um, it is saturated fat and sugar. And what they found, people eating diets that were higher in saturated fat, what type of thing? Full fat dairy, that's full fat cheeses, those those types of things, things that are perhaps indulgent and also uh, desserts that are high in sugar. So, for example, uh, some kind of chocolate, not dark chocolate, but a chocolate mousse would be fat and sugar. Those diets that are also relatively low in fruits and vegetables were the highest diet that was associated with both depression and anxiety. The researchers postulate that the reason for this is because that excess sugar, the wrong type of fat, is actually causing inflammation in the body in general and inflammation in the brain, which is the chemicals of the brain associated with mood. Let us remember that, as I've said in some previous uh, video blogs, inflammation is associated with mood disorders. It isn't just about serotonin and medications. Inflammation is part of that. And it turns out that foods are going to be inflammatory, certain types of foods like saturated fat, the wrong type of fat, like sugar. The other effect is those diets, that diet, it's not a healthy diet, low in fruits and vegetables. It's not good for the microbiome. And we know that there's a relationship between the brain and the gut. The gut brain access. In fact, 95% of all serotonin, it's not made here, it's made in the gut. So you muck around with your diet and what you'll end up with is an increased risk of depression, anxiety through inflammation and altering in a bad way your microbiome. Dr. Joe Feuerstein, thanks so much for tuning in.